Hey guys, so I am back with part two of my nuts.com uh, food and snack tour. So in my last video, I went through all the snacks that we had. I only tried two of them though. The last video, I had the molted, the ultimate molten milk balls and the chocolate coated coffee beans and they were awesome. This video, we're going to be trying the astronaut ice cream and the fudge. This is Oreo fudge. I never even heard of that flavor before. I've heard of peanut butter, never heard of Oreo fudge. So, actually, it's like cookies and cream fudge. So, I am excited. I want to try this one first. And I know I probably shouldn't, but I am. So, I got my scissors. The last video, I didn't have my scissors. <laughs> and I couldn't cut the um, thing off. If you want to check me out uh, using or eating the other treats, go to part one of this video. All right, I'm so excited. Okay. Let me crack it open. Oop. Oh, by the way, everything that you see me eat from uh, this video and the, the last video and this video only costs 50 bucks, including shipping. And you get a pound of each item. So, at least of the pound of the other two items. These, I'm not sure they're a pound, but still quite a nice amount. So let us try. It says Oreo cookie fudge and you get 12 yummy ounces. Okay. Let's try and get a piece out. I'm going to take too much out. So y'all can see me actually get it out. It's a little stuck in there. I love fudge. My first time ever eating fudge was when I went on a class trip to Baltimore. Uh, and it was, it was my first time going to Baltimore. And they specialize in, I think, seafood and fudge. And I love the fudge. I fell in love with fudge then. I've been in love with fudge ever since then. So that's what it looks like. It smells really milky and buttery. Soft. That smells really good. Ooh, so pretty. Let's try it. Ooh. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. He's sweet. <laughs> wow. That's really sweet fudge. You can taste the butter. I don't know if it's butter, but you can taste the... What's that? Decadence? That's the word. Very decadence in here. I won't be eating a lot of this. This will take me a long time to eat it. Definitely. I'm going to be taking my time it is a delicious morsel of deliciousness but you cannot eat a lot of this it is super sweet it's a uh, qu good quality i can taste the it tastes like the inside of an oreo cookie mostly like the the cream of the inside which can be like not a super amount of flavor i like a little bit more of the cookie flavor but let's take another bite I do like the milkiness of it. The smell is really good. The smell smells like sugar and milk. Very nice smell. It's very sweet though. So if you have a huge sweet tooth, you'll probably like it. And if you're a fan of the, if you are a type of person, this is how this is how I explain it. If you're a type of person that takes the, that eats the cream out of your Oreo cookies and then discards the Oreo, you would absolutely love this. This is just like the Oreo's cream. I am not. I would have preferred a more cookie flavor for myself, but I'm still happy I got it because it's just very beautiful to look at and fun to like pick off of, but I will be taking my time with it. So let's sit this guy down. And let's finally try the astronaut ice cream. I've been so excited about this one. Oh. I like they changed like the, the colorings a lot. It looks oh it could be more than I thought I was gonna get. I get three ice cream sandwiches. Now what astronaut ice cream is, if you don't know what it is, is supposed to be ice cream for astronauts. Now astronauts of course cannot eat uh real ice cream because it's, it would be impossible probably to ship real ice cream out so this is actual ice cream but it's freeze 
dried and it's an ice cream sandwich and it is it's like it's everything about ice cream just take out every ounce of water but let yet they keep the ice creams look i always was fascinated about this i always loved it i always thought it was so cool and that astronauts were awesome because of it i really really love that whole situation of astronaut ice cream that's just a little kid that's a little kid i absolutely loved it so my first time trying it was at uh the franklin institute and i loved it ever since i fell in love with it but you know i haven't had i bought it from i bought it uh astronaut ice cream online a little while ago like maybe about know, three four years ago on amazon but it was not this i was looking for this this is the one i ate when i was a little child this is the ice cream sandwich and I've been looking for this for so long. They didn't have that. So I haven't had this since I was probably, since about, gosh, 21 years ago. Oh my gosh, I'm 30 now. So probably about 21 years ago. So this is exciting. Let's eat the strawberry side first. It's so dry. This looks like an ice cream sandwich, but it's like mummy ice cream sandwich. It's so dry. That's so fun. I love that. Hmm. I'm gonna try to break a piece off. <laughs> oh, because it wants to fall apart. Oh my goodness. It wants to fall apart so badly. Hmm. Mm, that's how I remember it. <laughs> it does have a wild smell, though. The smell of it is kind of factory. That's something I don't quite remember. It could be the fact that this should be the strawberry smell. But it's got like almost a factory smell to it. It's kind of like off-putting. But the flavor is a lot of fun. Let's try another piece of it. Let's try chocolate. Who doesn't like chocolate? Oops. I, it's falling apart. Is that ice cream like it's like an ice cream cracker? That's fun. I feel like you get your money's worth because I'm like already like okay. Usually when I get this, I'm, I never feel like I get enough of it, but this is actually quite a nice amount. Uh, it's it's dry. It's super dry. It's like if somebody converted ice cream into a cracker. It's messy really 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 messy but still fun to eat the cookie part's a little bit hard but the ice cream part is why i remember as a child nice and soft I like, cookie, I like the ice cream part better than the cookie part but very fun let's take a few more bites of this <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if we can get to the vanilla. <laughs> I got more of that. And the vanilla is good. I have so much mess to clean up. Cause it's like falling everywhere. <laughs> so much fun. Really brings back to my childhood. Very fun. Okay, guys. So, that's basically it. I had a lot of fun. I cannot wait to just sit and watch movies. Because we're still in the quarantine. It is still May the 6th. And um, I did the videos back to back. Of course, it's a part two. And, uh, yeah. I'm going to be watching. Uh, just having a good old time. I actually... I want to talk about the mass Singer later. I actually want to talk about that in a different video. But I am going to just be eating snacks for so freaking long. And we want to recap of the ones that I already got. It was the multi, the ultimate milk balls, uh, the chocolate coated, uh, what's that like? Chocolate coated coffee was probably my favorite. I'm going to say chocolate coated coffee was my favorite of all my snacks. That one won. Uh, we have the astronaut ice cream and the fudge. And I bought awesome tapioca balls for my bubble tea. 
I tried to make, but I'm not going to make it right now, but I love that. So, this was a slide, super, lots of super fun, and um, I'll talk to y'all guys later, hopefully more reviews, and tell me, of all the food that I ate, which one would be your favorite? I'm talking from part one and two. Which one would be the your favorite? You're like, I need to have that one. For me, coffee wins. So, I'll talk to y'all guys later. Okay. Bye. Bye. <laughs>